The biggest myth that people struggle with regarding leadership is that they come to leadership positions thinking that it's about the work that needs to get done. And the reality is that leadership isn't about the work at all. Leadership is about the people. A seed can grow given the right soil. You put a seed in the refrigerator, it doesn't matter how robust the seed is, it's going to struggle to grow. The environment matters, and we as leaders control the environment. We don't necessarily control the seeds we're given, but we can definitely plant them in the right soil. Leadership is facilitating the manifestation of greatness in others. Everything that the leader does is to extract the best that exists in each of the people that they lead. One of my favorite quotes comes from Lao Tzu in the Tao Te Ching. And one of the things he says is the greatest leaders, the people barely know they exist. When their task is done, when their job is accomplished, the people say, we did it ourselves. Seventy percent of the factors related to employee engagement are related to leadership. Yes, sir. Somebody just told me you don't quit a job, you quit a manager. Man, it's like you've seen my slides. 50% <laughs> of people who leave their jobs do so because of their boss. Employees have this wonderful superpower when they don't want to work. They have this amazing ability when they're not interested and really don't care anymore about their job. They pick up the phone and they say, I quit. If somebody is showing up every day and coming into work, I think that they deserve at least the benefit of the doubt that there may be some other reason other than collecting a check that they're still there. Why aren't they passionate? Why aren't they working hard? Why aren't they doing more? What about our system doesn't inspire that? Make your employees feel like they're listened to, like they're heard, like they matter. Right? Cultivate, optimize your environment so that they can grow. Let me make them great. Let me focus on how to get them to do their best instead of feeling like I can work and just do it all myself. Because here's the key thing. When you look at that word manifestation, you're trying to bring the greatness out of people. The key to manifestation is that it requires engagement. And you already saw, right? Engagement gets you more effort, lower absenteeism, right? All of those things, people show up better. Manifestation requires engagement because they have to do something. It has to come out of them, so they have to be engaged for it. Here's the legacy leadership consulting difference. You already know how to be a good leader. You've seen good leaders. You know what good leaders look like. Why, if you know what good leadership looks like, can't you replicate it? It's not your fault. So often when we look at why aren't we doing what we know we should be doing, we think that there must be something wrong with me. I must not be working hard enough. I must not be trying hard enough. I must not care enough. None of that is the truth. You've been conditioned to be where you are currently. When you work with us at Legacy Leadership Consulting, we help you to figure out why you're not doing what you know you should be doing, and then we help you to overcome those obstacles.